Good afternoon guys, this is Simon with HSC here again. A little bit of a different location this time. I'm here because I want to show you something that has been really gaining a lot of interest lately. And that's using spraying drones for aquatic weed management. We've been getting a lot of interest in this lately. I want to show you why using a drone like this can be extremely beneficial for aquatic weed management businesses and how it can help you. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I want to show you a little project of mine. So this is actually my backyard. And as you can see, I'm on the water and it is a quite a nice view, but I have all of this mess in my way. You can see it's been untamed for a very long time. This is actually how I purchased the property. And you can see that there are weeds everywhere. Uh, it's not a very good look. It really needs to be taken care of. And my experiment that I'm gonna do here today is to show you how using a drone like this, our M6A Pro G200, which is a 16 liter spraying drone that's fully autonomous, with all kinds of incredible features can actually help with taking care of this. So there's a lot of companies out there that do backpack style spraying or whether it's from the shore or from a boat uh, to apply uh, herbicides to these types of weeds to control them. And it's very expensive, it's very time consuming, it's very laborious and uh, it's very difficult to do and it's hard to get in uh, consistent coverage in this type of terrain and this is just a small small area so you can imagine uh, in other applications like controlling ditches or um, larger lake uh, restoration areas lake fronts any kind of waterfront a drone is really an amazing tool to have i'm going to show you how it can save you time how it can sh uh, better apply the product and how it's repeatable and consistent. So I'm actually gonna set up an autonomous flight plan to spray this entire area right here. And we're gonna do it in just a few minutes from takeoff to landing. Let's go ahead and get started. Now that I've uh, put up the arms, folded out the props and uh, filled the tank. And for this case, for this demonstration, we're using water only. Um, I've actually went ahead and uploaded my flight plan and I just showed you guys how to do that. Um, so I'll go ahead and get it ready and we're actually going to do a flight now. So I'll show you the automation process and just how easy it is to operate this. Let's go guys. We're ready to take off. The aircraft is uh, passed all its pre-flight checks. So we'll go ahead and go to unlock. We'll go ahead and hit confirm. We'll slide over. We'll see the rotor start turning. We'll go ahead and hit start. Oh, sorry guys. There it is. Let's get a little closer so you can get a better view. So you can see it's now begun to start spraying. You can see one of the great advantages about spraying with a drone is just how much agitation you'll get from the rotors. You can even see it in the water back there. It's going to move over and come back now. There it is. You can bring it, adjust the altitude a little bit and bring it a little bit closer. So you can really see how much rotor wash it's pushing down into those cattails there. It's gonna move over. Also, you can hear how quiet and unintrusive this is. I'm obviously in a neighborhood here and not disturbing anybody, no loud noises. It's just doing its job. It's going out to the end there, going to the end. It's moving over. There we go. We can adjust the altitude and bring it down a little bit.
So you can see it's uh, actually finished. I made it a fairly small flight plan. It's coming back and returning home. Let's go ahead and get out of its way for its landing. It's coming back automatically. Again, I haven't touched the controller once. You can see the pattern it just did here. It's a little hard to see. It's coming back. It's gonna land automatically. Well, that was a nice smooth landing, huh? So we just sprayed the majority of this area and I did make the flight plan a little smaller here to check the tolerances of the GPS, but it was spot on. Um, but we sprayed that entire area in just a matter of a few minutes. Uh, I mean, that kind of job to do from a boat or from a handheld sprayer would take a lot, lot longer. I'm sure you guys that are doing that type of work out there will agree with me. This is an amazing tool for aquatic spraying. All right, guys, well, I hope you enjoyed that little demonstration there. I was really excited with how this uh, drone flew over these cattails. I mean, you can really see just how much downforce there is from those props. Uh, it, that just means that you're gonna get such a good application uh, from the um, product that you're applying. Uh, if you wanna learn more about this drone and a whole lot more, make sure to visit us at hse-uav.com. Uh, follow us on Facebook and make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel for further videos. There's going to be a whole lot more of uh, real-world applications with this drone. I hope that this video taught you something. Um, we're seeing more and more interest in uh, aquatic spraying, and uh, I just thought it'd be really interesting to just give you a quick demonstration of just how useful something like this is and how it can benefit your business. We'll talk soon. This is Simon with HSE. We'll see you next time. Bye.